then you have to reserve the space. You have to speak to someone from campus. It's not going to be a problem for you to do it, but you still have to make the reservation for it. Uh, because it's hard to distinguish between non-UIC students and UIC students. So we've had issues like that before. The last time they were in the quad, they got arrested. This is the information for them to call them and make a reservation. So whether you're students or a student org, it really doesn't matter. It's the fact that you have the right for free speech, but you have to make a reservation with them that you're going to be out here. So for today, you do have to pack it up. But call them and make sure to make a reservation. We have like four more things of ice cream. I'm just going to have to throw it away. You shouldn't be here to begin with. So That's an RSL? I'm sorry? As a registered student organization, you can't be outside on, on the public property? No, not freely like this in the quad. You have to make a reservation. All this space here, the space inside the building, and the grassy areas are reserved for many of the conferences. Okay, well, we'll just move it on a sidewalk then. Okay. Okay. That's fine. But and then, like I said, you can continue. You can do this. You just have to talk to them to be able to be doing it. Did you need their card? You can do it. Okay. All right. Oh, yes, I know. You should know this. Huh? You should know this. You shouldn't have to reserve a space on a public property. Like this is a public property. It's university public. property, though. It's a public university. Right. And that's exactly the point of why the open expression policy exists. Because, again, we've had people here who are not UIC and try to come in here because it's public property, but they cannot be here either unless they're supported by a student board and they have a reservation for it. So they're definitely getting stricter about it just because we've had a lot of altercations lately. We've had a group we arrested over there. Um, and we had a group yesterday that we arrested inside the building, which was a little stricter. But yes, you do have to make a reservation. Do you know where's the policy that says that? Here, let me just pull it up for you. Because I think I still have your number. I can text this to you. students um, that was a group that got arrested because they wouldn't leave they were protesting abortion um, they, uh, you shouldn't oh, be allowed to have a, yeah, abortion or something. That, yeah. and it just became this big thing in the quad but then we discovered they weren't even students to begin with so they were definitely arrested they stayed and got arrested yeah, I have the video of that actually. This is too uh, that we're really put on the group. And only one guy ever got arrested, and then they just Ooh. agreed to walk away anyway. So, are you part of this club or something? Yeah. Nice. That's Interesting. Cool. Okay, that's cool. How could you like to change? I already made so many oh, things. Otherwise, I would. It looks like it's She said that. Did you get the petition? Yeah. She gave the petition of the group meeting. Yeah, she signed the petition. Yeah. 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 Do the passcode and add it to the group meet. Uh -huh. There isn't a password. Just post the button. This is Oregon camp. You should join our group meet as well. I think it's like okay. Yeah, I don't think it's like. What's your number? Uh, seven zero eight. Yeah, this is five seven three. Eight eight seven two. So that's the link to the open expression.